hey wonderful people welcome back to my channel so our next video is from valutainment valutainment and it says you sound triggered candice owen and chris kumu have heated debate over putin let's check it out picking a metric of what's the guy's iq is not enough for me first of all he did not give you i'll tell you why i'll tell you why because it's what do you do with your intelligence? You think he gave you an accurate recitation of Russian history starting in the 8th century because Candace just said so. She's wrong and you're wrong, okay? He did not give you an accurate recitation. He gave you a KGB doctored look at why it's okay that he wants to reestablish the Soviet Union. That's what he gave. Oh, stop and it. it. Listen, Listen, Stop I'm not it. here to play Russia good, Russia bad, okay? Russia has a it, smaller GDP than California. He's so not, what? It's just, like, it, it's so like, what? It, They're also are, invading a country right now just for that avarice. Americans are, are economically Look, so unintelligible I, that they are going to believe what I'm that saying the threat is, that we are facing today is Russia trying to reestablish. So this is like Cold War propaganda. We got to we got to move on from that. Okay. But it's it, just it, as real now is, it, as it was the 1960s. then. And remember, in America, these people are allowed to be here right now doing things they could never do in Russia. Never. Nobody can speak out against Putin. He is at over 75% in popularity polls because people know what happens if you answer differently. They make no money. They have no press freedoms. When they try to exercise themselves even on the internet, it's starting to they sound get like chased. America today because January well, Sixers and, are locked and that up is, for and a that long thing. You locked up grandmas for expressing their opinions. That is something to be concerned about. You are saying that, is that something if you to speak, be concerned about. It, that is correct. not admired, of press, you're but used here, as a point of fear. They wanted to arrest Tucker Carlson for going over to speak to a leader of a country that we are allegedly not at listen, war with. I, listen. So you're you're also describing America while you are telling us- I am us not describing America. Yeah, I'm you, describing what America should not be. So be careful about putting up a model of what you think has some value. Nobody said there That's was a model. We just said that That's it's very obvious that Putin can complete a sentence and that Biden can't. Yeah, and he I'm can not, complete I, a I, sentence. This, he can this, also this likely murder his vibe. opponents. And that's a function of his intelligence also, because it's not guided by any sense of morality. And that matters, too. And Tucker making the decision. Gonzalo Lira was just killed by Zelensky. He, He's a thug. We shouldn't be supporting listen, Ukraine at all, not a look, single dollar. He, even if that were true, which neither of us know whether it is, then that's a policy argument. Have the policy argument. The idea of good and evil, right and wrong, cheapens it. It cheapens it. But you and just did that. You no, just, you, I'm not you, you doing it. I'm doing the opposite. The fact I'm that not I triggered. That, what are you, 19? That Are you using 19-year-old woke language now that I'm triggered? Okay, are you I'm just, not triggered. I got my legs crossed. It means I'm comfortable. Okay, mm -hmm. uh, well, you just seemed a little triggered. You, like, well, I don't like setting up Putin as triggered. a model. I, I, I didn't. Nobody here, everyone is listening to what I said, and I'm going to not just double down. I'm going to triple down, quadruple down on the fact that it's very obvious to the American people yes. that our leaders are extremely lackluster, Agreed. and that has been made even more Agreed. abundantly I said clear after having watched Tucker Carlson sit across from Vladimir Putin, which was heroic on his part, because we are tired of being propagandized. We are tired of people pretending, if you live in Russia, there's going to be so much propaganda. There's so much propaganda here. I agree. Okay, we are suffering from the exact... See, guys, Candice Owens is not backing down and keeping her composure and reasoning intact. Like, it's so pretty cool. I just love the way she's talking against Kumu. Seriously. On January 6th, three of my friends had FBI agents, they didn't even step foot in the Capitol, okay? Had FBI agents show up because they were, they wanted any person that even showed up to hear Trump speak on January 6th mm -hmm. to feel threatened by that because the establishment said that you weren't allowed to support Donald Trump, okay? So I'm gonna speak to how the public is feeling right now. And we are very aware of the fact that Joe Biden could potentially be dead right now, okay? We don't even know, like, he, he can barely make it through a sentence. And when we see somebody you do like know Vladimir that Joe Putin, Biden is who not is dead, able right? to, is mm -hmm. what? You do know that Joe Biden's not dead. In cheek. And you do know that he that wasn't was shot up with something no, I actually before don't. I he actually, went out there. I actually uh, do believe I, he was shot I up with adrenaline before come he goes. I think, on. What do you mean, come on? JFK come on. used to do that. Come on. So it's like, at, Listen, it, they obviously the truth are giving him drugs before he speaks. The truth is enough. And I'll tell you why it becomes problematic, okay? Look. 
It's a half joke. They shot Biden up with something it's last night. It's not a half joke. I but really here's believe what, that. I here's what happens. Well, look, if you really believe that, yes. that's fine. It would be just nice to have a basis for it. But yeah, yeah he's going to take a drug test. Okay. Look, here's what here's what's going to happen. Here's what's going to here's here's what's going to happen. Okay. Just trust me on this because you've already seen it. You you're going to know that it's already true. You are allowing for a BS standard of appraisal. So now... Intelligence is a BS standard. It's not intelligent. It's the shooting up part. So now they'll start showing clips of Trump where it seems that he's not speaking fluidly. And they'll talk about whether he's on drugs. And they did that already. They will, but, uh, but, that's what you, but that's what you enable with this. I'm saying just stick with the truth. Are our leaders performing the way we need them to be? It's a rhetorical question. No. You had in Congress last night, um, I forget who smacked me with this stat, but it was a great one. 14% popularity for members of Congress, right? That yeah. sounds about right. It's somewhere between 12% and 20%, depending on the poll. 94% re-election rate. How do you have such low popularity and such high re-election rate? because the game is rigged. That's why. Now, the truth is enough, okay? Just stick with the truth. The problem is when you get into these situations of comparing a guy who's just a bad guy with what you want in your own leadership, I don't think it sends you to the right the place. The truth is that Vladimir Putin was able to communicate in a way that was coherent. Would you want Vladimir it's, Putin it, to is, be your president? A, this is such a fine statement. Would you want Vladimir Putin to be your president? That's not what I said. I'm asking you a question. That's not what I said. I'm asking no, you a question. No, but you're asking the question because you still cannot deal with the fact that I yes. have accurately described Vladimir Putin as coherent. He is. There's no question he's coherent. I'm Do just saying. Do you think he's smart? I think he's an intelligent man, yes. Uh, that's all I said. Oh, my God, we got there. We can move on. No, Good. Listen. Oh, my God, we got there. No. And we, it's just, that's all I said, right? But okay, it's cool. about why you're using okay. him as an instruction. Because I have sat across from serial killers that are intelligent men. Uh, because I, I don't I, want them deciding my taxes. Did I say that I wanted Vladimir Putin to decide my taxes? But why, but why hold, hold sure him up as an example? Of, why of, hold him up as an example? Because we are talking about it's the like American people's It's like when Trump said Duterte mindset. is a tough guy. Everyone Why is able to that? comprehend this, so I'm going to reset it one more time. One more time. Okay? We are talking about the State of the Union. I am talking about the mindset of yes. Americans that understand this is all very performative and the insult yes. to have him up there as if he is the leader of our nation, especially following the interview that we all watched in which Vladimir Putin first and foremost made it clear that it's, he doesn't I hear view it. our leaders as even leading the country. He views them all as puppets and that he I deals, hear it, but he you're still using Putin as a positive comparison okay, so is, to is, who we have. We, I mean, I don't know what I'm missing in terms of this, the logic. This is how I take it, uh, 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 Chris. I'm, I'm, this is how I take it from the outside. Uh, I take it as I want to know everybody's leader on how they are, how formidable they are, yes. and can mine go up against that leader? If Putin and Biden are in a negotiation table, we're going to lose. Yeah, that's, that's, a, that's all I'm thinking about. So for me, I, I think about somebody being able to sit up against them to say, hey, you got to knock it off with this Ukraine stuff. By the way, let's process this in a different way. We had, uh, 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 I don't know who I was having this conversation with. It's like, well, you know what? What do you think about this? And what do you think about that? I said, listen, we have four years of data, pure data of what happened under Trump. They can't play that same game as, aren't you afraid that he has access to the button? He's actually one of the 46 people ever who had access to the button and never used it, and there was no wars, right? For four years, it was peaceful. We didn't have no Ukraine, nothing, Afghanistan, nothing going on, no Israel, Hamas, nothing going on, right? This guy's here, he's got access to everything for three years. What do we have going on? What we did with Afghanistan, they're wearing our uniform now. What happened with Ukraine and Russia? What happened with Israel and Hamas? According to pure data, one doesn't know how to sit across another alpha and say, Check yourself, stop, you cannot behave like this again. That's purely how I process the difference between Putin and Biden. I don't sit there and look at Biden and say, man, I, I can't wait for this guy to go into the boardroom. He's going to crush it in the boardroom behind closed doors negotiating. I say, please don't keep it uh, behind closed doors. I want to see exactly how he's going to be negotiating. He doesn't give... Wow, guy, like... Pat, I think Pat is a, uh, is a genius. Like, for the fact that he in interjected the conversation and provided a meaningful insight, opinion that made Adam nod his head. 
in such a good manner like a class like i don't even understand i love the fact of what he said truly if they put biden and put it together truly america will lose so why you going on it or you going to support putin on or other states why don't you support your state why don't you support your country let your country stand see the things that are lacking in your country before you lend a helping hand out to to outsiders or to another country see candice candice oh, is proving once again that that this work does cannot win a debate a debate like but i don't know why kumo is always interrupting always talking ahead of him like i don't get it but i just love for the fact that candice always set him right like candice always prove facts but one thing i don't get is that why going out to support trump i said trump sorry putin when your own country is on fire i don't get it why let me know your thoughts in the conversation, like, watch, and subscribe to my channel, and have a wonderful day ahead. Bye-bye.